Hey, what's going on guys? It's Pat and welcome back to Minecraft Epic Proportions. And as you can see, we are back home once again. And I have something special for today. I know we've killed Mobzilla, so what do we do next? I like fell in the water. We are actually going to be heading to the Crystal Dimension. If you guys remember, a few weeks back, I reviewed the new update to Aura Spawn. And it adds in a brand new dimension made of crystals. It's actually pretty cool looking. So I figured, why not head there today? And I found the spawner. It took me a while because it's pretty rare. And I brought it back home with us. And if you're wondering why I am naked, it is because you can't bring anything with you into this dimension. Nothing. But you can take stuff back out, which is kind of cool. So if we get some awesome stuff, we can bring it back to the overworld. So we're kind of starting anew in this dimension. We'll try to, like, move our way through it at a decent pace. So I'm not, like, you know, without armor and weapons for very long. But, whoa, did you see how many ants came out of that? Oh, termites. Like, the same thing. All right, so I guess we're heading in. Guys, it is a little bit laggy if you're... Oh, God. I want to go to the dimension. Don't do that. All right, here we go. This dimension's laggy, and you're going to notice why, like, instantly. Because it is made of pure crystals. So, guys, here we are in the crystal dimension. You could probably tell why it lags. I could see every single thing all the way down to bedrock, which could definitely cause some problems. What's that? That is a peacock spawner. Cool. I guess it dropped off one of the peacocks around here. So, we need to grab a lot of stuff. And before anything bad happens, and there's some lag, I do want to apologize for any possible lag issues in this video. I allocated 16 gigabytes of RAM for today, so... um. Hopefully that'll make a difference. I don't really know, but we'll find out. Is that more wood? There's like random wood. All right, let's get all this and try to prepare ourselves for the night. Because the night is extremely dangerous here. It's like really, really bad. Is that a peacock? All right, so I got some tree wood. All right, I'll turn this into planks. Make a crafting table. Doesn't it kind of look like a medical like symbol thing? I don't know if that's like a bad sign for this place being really evil. See another egg. It is really cool looking, though, this place. What? Ooh, I think that actually um, over there might be one of the above-ground dungeons. It's not really a dungeon. It's kind of a tree with a chest under it and a spawner. And I can actually see the spawner, so probably going to want to make something before I head over there. Okay, so some shards. I think that's like a stick. Pickaxe to break it. Awesome. So, yeah, so far, not too bad on the lag issue, so... Hopefully things will stay good. Kind of afraid about nighttime. All right, a sword, perhaps a shovel. All right, anything else we like really need? Because the wood breaks so easily with my hand, I was thinking we wouldn't even need an axe. We might though. I like how everything breaks so so simple. Normally it's a pain in the ass. All right, give me all this stuff. All right, I see the chest, guys. Ooh, apples, apples. All right, I got to break the spawner before, you know, we get in trouble here. Was it just a fairy spawner? What is in this chest? Ooh, peacock feather chest plate. Let me grab everything. Oh, they broke it. They broke the chest as I was taking this stuff out. That is just rude. All right, so let me get somewhere that's not near these things. Perhaps up here. Can I even climb up this? Interestingly enough, Reyna still works fine. They can't climb this, right? I feel like they're trying to. All right, so this is what we got. A peacock feather chest plate. That looks kind of cool, right? Crystal tree leaves. Can I do anything with leaves? No. Um, I got a couple of these dudes. Oh, I think they're for something important. A I don't know how to say it. All right, so that is for the arrow. All right. So, yeah, there's like a special arrow. And if I... What about this thing? If I use this, I'm trying to see exactly what everything does. Yeah, it makes this, like, really cool air. I think it's, like, really powerful. And it comes off the dudes we just got the thing from. All right. So, anything else important here? Rice. Got some food. Probably going to need this. We got apples and we've got rice. Anything with these flowers? Not really. Okay, so I think we are ready to keep exploring here. Probably going to need more armor. Just saying. Give me all these apples. This tree is awesome. It's like dropping apples everywhere. You know, this might be a good spot for a shelter. It might not be bad. If there wasn't so many of you things, leave me alone. All right, anything else around here? Oh, God, the lag is going to kill me. I said it wasn't that bad, but now it's 
every once in a while when we move, it just it just takes over. Like there's nothing that can be done about it. What is this? It looked a little bit different. It was a termite nest. Oh, the termite nest. That's where they're coming from. Yeah, this is a horrible spot. Give me that apple. All right, so let's check around the area a bit. I want to stay away from the termites because they're driving me crazy already. There's a lot of these, actually. There's a lot. We should check them all. Because <laughs> if we can get a lot of cool stuff and a lot of armor during the day, we'll be ready for the night. All right, anything in here? I already have a crystal wood pickaxe. Ooh, legs. Pink tourmaline leggings. Got some fairies. Okay. Is there fairies? Interesting. <laughs> some rice. I already got a pickaxe, so I don't need that. But let's throw on the pink legs. Ugh. My character weeps whenever I put on pink. All right. There's a lot of these, so we should probably get everything we can out of this. And all the food, too. Damn it. <laughs> I can't stand this lag. It's driving me crazy. Guys, let me know if you want me to continue in this dimension. If the lag is just too unbearable, then I won't do it. <laughs> let me know on that. I'm trying to make it, like, not painful. All right, crystal energy. If I use this... Oh, for the torches. Okay, so we're going to need torches, aren't we? Where's the sun? I, oh, my God. That's one of the really awesome dungeons, but, of course, it's about to be night. Hmm. How do you make a bed? This worries me. How do we make a bed? Like to avoid the first night if possible here. Um, that's Lion King, Elvin, Wood Elvin. Is there another way to make these here? There's someone that drops wool. I'm not so sure. But yeah, it's getting dark, guys. And with darkness comes, you know, night. Does the apple give you a special buff? I'm not sure on that. Oh, it oh, two and a half minutes? Okay, so mobs, come at me. Come at me, bro. Not that there's anyone near me at all. All right, so these apples are actually really good. And there's tons of stuff for dungeons over here. All right, we've got to conquer these. Oh, my God. Is that the boss? Please don't tell me I found the boss already. Yeah, guys, there's um, there's a boss in this dimension. And I see, like, two of them over there. That's wonderful. The ultimate sword. Oh, my God. The ultimate sword. Oh, my God. We have a chance. We have a fighting chance in this dimension, guys. We've got the ultimate sword. We're buffed up. Come over here. Come over here. I'm surprised it's not lagging worse at night. You'd think it'd be really bad. It's so beautiful, yet so evil and confusing. I'm torn. Oh, rare spawn thing. Don't fight me. Okay, I'm not here. You don't see me. You don't see me. We don't see each other. Die. Kill it. I got the ultimate sword, guys. We're gonna be alright. It's exact Ooh, nice stuff. Alright, so I would assume this is better. Who hit me? Oh! Oh god. Here comes the Vortex boss. We got the ultimate sword here though. So yeah, we earned this. We found an awesome chest, and I'm gonna kill the boss! Oh, I killed it! I I'm about to die though. Oh god. Alright, we need this regeneration. Need it right now. Wow. Yeah, we killed the boss of this dimension and in the first like 10 minutes in here and the lag has subsided a bit too cool honestly hmm i'm thinking about it i was wondering if we could do this in one go like the whole dimension like check out all the dungeons there's one over there i think there's two on the surface it's the ones like this and then um the ones in the air and then underground so if we can i might just try to do this in one go if possible here because i know it's a little laggy and i would hate to put up too many laggy things i hate to do that all right, we got to be careful. These mobs are serious. And our defense is not high enough yet. <laughs> Work better. Thank you. Thank you so much. Appreciate that. All right, so let me um, see here. But yeah, this actually lights up at night too. So I checked both these, right? Just want to make sure I don't miss anything cool. This one's blast protection. Oh, protection too. That's going to be better. I need boots. Oh, I got a bunch of ingots. Oh my god, this is awesome. Okay. How did my inventory get this full so quickly? All right, so let's get some, let's get a helmet here. All right, and let's get boots. We got the perfect amount. Wow. Okay, cool. So I'm put these on. Let me um actually put this you know in the other slot, and I can put the pickaxe right there in the shovel. Should we dual wield it with this? Let's do that. That looked really weird. It's all right though. I'm cool with it. 
And we've got rice right there. Okay, I'm going to eat the rice when we don't need a buff. Because right now, I think we're good. Should we try to take down another one of those bosses if we see one? That's what I'm thinking now. Because they dropped some really good stuff. It might be worth it. What are you? You're dead is what you are. All right, just checking around. I don't see any more. I know we saw a couple right when we came in before. See fairies. I know it's dangerous out here. Be careful. Hmm. All right, guys. I'm not seeing too much boss or mob-wise at all. Things seem pretty tame from here. But this is a dungeon. And we need to get up there. So we're going to do that. Got rats. I got 20 planks to climb on to get myself up to, like, a higher area. It's probably going to be the easiest way to do this, actually. So, guys, I still am working on setting up for the next series. I'm not. I'm trying not to rush it, you know what I mean? Like, I'm trying to get it set up, though. I've got a lot of cool mods, and I'm really, really hoping that Jen is going to join me on the next one. Because I think it would be a lot more fun, you know, playing with her as well. I think I made it. What do I do up here? What is this place? I'm just kidding. I kind of have an idea of what I'm doing. Um, but, oh, a chest. Okay. Oh, a wood hoe. You know, I, I didn't make one. You know, I never give the hoes any love either. I never, I never actually make them. I never garden. I'm not much of a gardener, as you guys can tell. All right, so I guess we got to climb up here. Luckily, Reina is a beast. And we can get to these chests really easily. All right, peacock, feather legs. Got some skates. All right. Another hoe. I'm going to get rid of the crappy one. Some more flowers. I'm not going to worry about the pickaxe. All right, so I see a spawner over there, but let me get these chests first. All right, let's see. Some more skates. Tiger eye ingots. All right, if I use these. So this one's a little bit stronger, and I've got four. So let me save them up and see if we can get some more, because um, it's definitely better than the pink set. Plus, it's not as, you know, weird looking. I don't, I don't like pink. I don't like wearing it. It's not really my thing. All right, can we get up here? There we go. Okay. Ooh, lots of food, too. Cooked peacock, ghosts. Got an axe. Cool. Wow, there's there's so much stuff. I don't know what to do with it. All right, so I've got myself an axe now. Can I put that? Th that'd be, that's sad. I'm actually gonna... Hmm. Because I don't really need to dual wield this. I can put... I can't do that. What am I trying to do? Where can I put this? I don't need the shovel, I guess, right now. Let's see here. Let us get up here. There's so many spawners, but it seems like they're fairy spawners, so they're not very dangerous or anything. There's a lot of chests around. I'm trying to get to all of them. Can I climb up here? My head, keep, I keep banging my head. Oh, there's nothing up there anyway, I don't think. No. All right, let's try to maneuver ourselves towards um, the other spots. All right, going this way. Please don't make me fall. That'd be so bad because we're so high up right now. Oh, that scared me. All right, this thing, broken. Nothing up there. How about, like, all the way? No chest. So, yeah, we couldn't bring anything with us. So, obviously, I can't use my mounts to fly around like we normally do. Making this a little bit more difficult to try to get this stuff. This is not easy. All right, let's go over here. I got all the stuff in the center. Pretty sure on that. Checking. Making sure. Right, can we make this jump? Jump! Ooh, okay. We made it. This is this is so annoying. This is the weirdest dungeon ever. Jump up here. Oh, okay. You know what? You know, I'm sick of this. I'm sick of this, guys. Let's just let's just do this. The lazy way. Alright, switch back and get rid of this here. I think we got almost all the different um, chests. Then I definitely want to try to make something if possible. Because we ended out with a lot of those. Well, not a lot. We got some of those materials. All right. So chest-wise, of the ones I've missed, I'd say maybe that little one right there. God, this place is freaking huge. <laughs> there's definitely one there, though. We got to get to that. It's that there's multiple dungeons right next to each other, it looks like. And that's why I'm seeing, like, so many in the air. All right, let's get that, and, hmm. Should we... We can make this. Let's make sure we make this. I don't feel like going all the way down there right now. All right, now, I can't screw this up, hopefully. We'll see. Jump! Oh, God. All right. Got this one down. And if you guys haven't noticed, the lag... It hasn't lagged in at least five minutes, so things are... Things are looking up, right? Is it a tree? All right. 
And in here, tree leaves, a ghost, termite nest, planks. Yeah, another spawner. Let's take a look at the land from up here, actually. Kind of cool. All right, so we need to get to that other chest I mentioned. I'm pretty sure that's the only one we missed in this tree. Obviously, there's one, like, that way, too. But I don't feel like exploring trees the whole time we're here. Obviously, it's going to get really boring if I'm exploring these dungeons. Because they're kind of just, like, me hopping around. This would be really hard to do without Reyna, by the way. Like, impossibly hard. All right, so did I, re did I not get this one? Can I just do it this way? Let's just try to get it from below. Open it. All right, rotators. So a lot of these are spawn eggs, so it's not really too bad. Okay, so I'm going to make the... What are they? I'm going to make the boots because they're a little bit better. Put this down. We've got... um. Where are they? We've got these. The tiger's eye ones. Something just fall in front of my face. So I got the boots on, guys, and I think I've organized myself good now. I got rid of the diamond legs because really there isn't enough room in our inventory to hold on to... um. Really, any of this stuff, we can't bring backpacks with us, so I already have, you know, diamond legs on. I think we are pretty much set. Got the pink helmet, the peacock chest plate, diamond legs, and the tiger eye boots. So, I think we are ready to head down, and let's go to a dungeon, actually. Let's go down. You see that right there? That, like, ore? Let's try to head to that, if possible. There's probably some cool stuff down there. A lot of chests, you could see them through the ground, so... Am I, like, I'm trying to get near this. Like, where is um, the way towards this? All right, so let's just go down, and we'll find out what happens here. So I got a shovel. This is going to be, you know, quite the adventure today. Okay, so clearly this is not the right block. All right, that only works on the dirt, because this is some kind of stone-type block here. What is this, actually? Kyanite? If I, oh, there is a kyanite set, huh? There's no armor or anything. It's like stone, basically. All right, so we're heading down. Is it me or is it looking creepier as we go? Look at this. It looks really scary with the bedrock, like, showing up. But I want to grab this. I think it's all the pink ore. Not that we need too much of it. I just want to see, really, more than anything. Are you going to break? Or no? What is... Oh! Oh, God. Okay. 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 <laughs> it blew up on me. So, this is used to make... So, it did make it, but it blew up. Does it always do that? I don't think so. Um, Let's try it from here. Don't hurt me. Please. Okay, so it can be fine. And honestly, we don't need a lot of this right now. And I think it's going to take us a while to dig through it. So, let's actually head down into the dungeons. Let's do it. Let's go, guys. I know you can find, like, a spot where the bedrock is open, and hopefully we can do that. I think we're getting close, plus I see a chest I really want to get to. All right, let us in. Actually, I see the opening spot, like, right over there. You see how it's not bedrock, and it looks like some kind of crystal? That is where we're going to head. Let me just try to get over here. All right, almost there. This is such a weird place. I got to say, one of the weirdest dimensions I've ever seen, but I actually really like it. Now the lag has subsided, I'm enjoying it a lot more than when we first got here. Alright, let's try to get to that. Come on. To the dungeon. And I think there's dungeon beasts down here as well. Alright, so see how this looks so weird? Like, now the bedrock's there, and you can't really get past that. Huh, okay, so, no, I couldn't reach that. <laughs> now I'm just kind of searching around and hoping we can find a way into this. Oh, God. There's got to be a way in around here somewhere. You can't even tell until you break it. So right now, it's all bedrock. So guys, I will see you when we find one. All right, guys. I found a spot to enter the dungeon. Took me a little time, but we got it. I, oh, <laughs> they trolled me. They trolled me so bad right there. All right, I see how it is. Got to find another one. Okay, guys. I found another one. Please don't do this to me again. Oh, God. This is getting painful to find the way into this dungeon. They're trying to kill me here, guys. So, guys, they say the third time is a charm, and I am just praying at this point. You can see I made myself a Kyanite pickaxe because mine broke. 
And, oh, finally, finally. This, I went far. I dug a long time, and it's nighttime, and it looks beautiful. Look at this stuff. All right, so we're heading into the dungeon. I'm just going to toss on um, this buff right here because I think we're going to need it. There's lots of scary stuff around. All right, so let's go. Let's do this. Hello? Dungeon beasts. Oh, God. All right, they mean business, but luckily we have a beastly weapon as well. So we made it into the dungeon, guys. This is awesome. Oh! Oh, God. Okay. I'll see you later. There's so many of these, too, and I just could not find one. Oh, God. All right, let's go. Let's go, bro. Oh, is he crying now? He has 260 health. Dungeon beast. Come on. Let's do this. All right, one more hit on him. Shoot fireballs at us. You die. Got a chest, finally. Did he go this way? See an apple. It's strange. All right, let me get back to my chest that I was about to loot. All right. Oh, God, this place is confusing. Yeah, seriously, guys, this is a maze, and I swear I lost the chest already. Don't worry. There's like a million. There's a million turns. In the video, it's really easy to tell, like, you know, which way I went. But when you're in one of these places, you take a turn, and you're like, oh, God. All right, so let's see. Did you really fall out of the world if you wanted to? I guess so. It looks bright over here, doesn't it? It's got to be a spawner. Or is it just the light from... It's from the outside, actually. Wow. Yeah, this is a maze. Really, I'm not very good at mazes. I kind of just wander around aimlessly. I got a chest plate, but do I really need it? What is hurting me? Is it? It's freaking rats. The rats are after me. We already have a peacock feather chest plate. You know, I guess the, um, this one's got better durability. <laughs> just, you know, I don't want to ruin my inventory space on small things, you know? All right, so let's see here. This dungeon, lots of dungeon beasts. The hallways are, are like torture. Plus, obviously, you can't break through this unless you have like some kind of special mod installed. I'm sure there is some, you know, that will break through bedrock for you. But very dangerous down here. All right, I see another chest, guys. Try to find as many as we can so we can get some cool stuff to bring home with us after we, um, you know, beat this place. Which it looks like we're going to do in one go. We killed the boss from the dimension. We've been in every single dungeon. So I don't really want to waste time, like, you know, not doing much. I like to get a lot of stuff done, and we are beasting it right now. But the lag is, is destroying my heart. I see your face, by the way. You must be behind there. All right, let's have one of these cool apples. Actually, this the, the apples are great to bring back with us. I know you're around here. No? Seriously, where are you? I saw your face. All right, never mind. But yeah, probably the apples are going to be the most useful thing we can bring back with us. Let's see here. Oh, this is just painful. I'm so sorry, guys. I really apologize for the lag spikes we're getting here. All right, so got some rotators. You know what we should do? Honestly, we've explored the dimension pretty well, I'd say. But we got some cool spawners. Why not do some fighting down here, right? I think it'd be cool. All right, so fairies, they are just they don't do anything. Let's get some rotators out here and massacre them. Just to make it easier, I'm going to put this in my hand next to it. All right, so rotators. And here's the weapon. Kill them. Should I just spawn them all in like this? There's so many. Let's get some fighting going. Take some damage here. You hear lightning? He's actually drop. They're actually dropping a bunch of jewels for us for um crafting stuff too. All right, the rotators are dead. Let's see what else we got here. Um, if I remember correctly, this guy. Uh, I'm not even gonna fight him because I remember he kills you in one hit. I can't remember if it's if you hit him with your hand or your sword. I think it's your hand. I'm afraid of it. This thing's crazy. It's got one health. Then I just remember when I was messing with the mod, it killed me in one hit. And the last thing I want to do. Is murder myself right now. Let's try um let's try to skate. Yeah, you look really tough. Really, really tough. Here comes a rotator again. Alright, let's get it. So yeah, anything difficult in here? It'd be kind of cool if we oh ghosts. Let's try ghosts. I haven't seen any of those around. Alright, ghosts. Bring in the ghosts. Alright, there isn't too much to them. They're really, really dark. 
I'm thinking you might not even be able to see them in the video. They're so dark. Because I can barely see them at all. Alright, there's a torch. Alright, let's get some more skates. I'm pretty sure these are supposed to be in water, so they're probably really, really unhappy right now. But I guess this is how you get string in this dimension. Alright, what else we got here? I left a couple alive. I will never do that again. Alright, let's see. So, I got crystallized, like, versions of everything, too. Rats. I got fairies. Whale. <laughs> Should we just spawn a whale in down here? You're probably really unhappy. Where's that water coming from, anyway? There's no water down here, bro. Kill you with this. They actually have a lot of health. Oh, god, Dungeon Beast. Alright, that is dead. Let's kill the whale. You drop anything cool? Drop some fish. 27 fish. Wow. But yeah, guys, I think that is about all we are going to show in this dimension. We killed the main boss of the dimension, explored all the dungeons, got some cool stuff to bring back home, and really did a, we really did a lot of stuff in one episode. So I'm going to do the fanchion right now. Um, let me just try to avoid, like, you know, all these things. Got a piece of paper with everyone's names written down for today. And the winners were... I'm, trying, I'm just going to run and do this at the same time. <laughs> what does it have to be? I have one more apple make sure we don't get killed. All right, so today's winners were TJ Matthew, Zombie Gamer 7, Jackson Otis, Icy Glacia, and these two kings, 0305. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to slam that like button, and I will see you guys next time for another Minecraft video.